Let's play our yes or no game called I'd Swallow That. There's only four. I'm going to make four statements, and if the hosts agree, they'll take a shot. Mm. I'd Swallow That is sponsored by the LGBTQ plus community's favorite spirit brand. Bacardi is the world's most loved rum brand. Bacardi is diverse as our LGBTQ plus community. Our neighbors here in South Florida, they are the world's largest privately held spirits company. Bacardi is also a legacy name in their support for the LGBTQ plus community with sponsorships, pride enhancements, embracements, and a deep passionate support of our LGBTQ plus charities and causes. And that's why tonight, It's Happening Out plays I'd Swallow That with our favorite rum, rum drink, Bacardi. Yay! Woo! Here we go. All right, question number one. Mm -hmm. Look around the table and you'll notice that our dear Faye Watt and Al Ferguson no. are not around tonight. While they're busy doing some personal work, we thought it, we would take over this week's It's Happening Out and do it our way. Yes. We are going to have way more fun than usual. Yes. <laughs> Say that again, but sound fun. <laughs> We're going to have way more fun than usual. I feel like he said it just like Al. <laughs> I, know, I, just, I need a couple shots. That's what it is. <laughs> With a Bacardi shot, I'd swallow that. While Al and Faye are away, the It's Happening Out cast will play. Yes. yes. Salud. Cheers to that. And I'm, by right now, I'm Jay What? Jay what? Yeah, I'm just a prettier version of Faith. Oh my God, you are with bigger tits. So, so, I do have bigger tits. You got bigger tits, tits right? Tits. So, bigger so tits. how many of us thought that they, they're in Al's Volvo right now, being Thelma and Louise in his old ass Volvo, like running down and she's beating him with it right at the heel of her shoe <laughs> as he's driving in that old ass Volvo I mean, from the house of Volvo. Not house of Volvo. House of Volvo. House of Volvo. All the way from the OG episode. I feel like this hour, Al's probably just under a boy. I don't know why. I just feel like under. Right? It's almost nighttime. I mean, it is his birthday. Right? They got to get it over with. Is it his birthday? Oh, oh, this week. Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, there's definitely a boy inside there's his belly. Right, right now. Yeah, you gotta hurry up. They got school in the morning. So. They, they got school in the morning. <laughs> no, it's summer. School's out for the summer. That one will be in summer school. Well, do, they they go to, <laughs> do they go to school in Cuba? I don't think they go to school. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Maybe he's getting round two of that lipo. That he, that he getting that fixed, but he yes. messed up the last show. Remember? I around eight. Oh, my. Is this the first time those two old hags haven't been on this show? Yeah. The first time ever? I think so. I'm going to take a second here? shot. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh. All right. Next. <laughs> if we don't have Faye. Look, we're missing a topic. Right there here. should have been five that's of these. Sunday school hands. Right, right here, That's all you need. Ready. All right. We are Queer News Tonight, the world's first and only live daily LGBTQ plus evening news show brought to you from Happening Out Television Network. We operate in the same model of PBS and NPR, but for the LGBTQ plus community. We educate, inform, and entertain by supporting the 10 pillars of our LGBTQ plus community with more than 100,000 a week watching us on Roku, Apple Television, and other channels. To keep the story going, we accept donations with 100% transparency. Stay updated and live authentically with Queer News Tonight.